swivel doing applications of derivatives today we are going to start the topic tangents and normals tangents and normals mein hum jo sabse pehle topic karenge that is slope of tangents and normals clear now hamare paas kya formula hai slope of tangent nikalne ka अगर हमें कोई भी कर्व वाई दी है स्लोप ऑफ टेंजेंट इज डी वाई अपॉन डी एक्स वी डिनोटेड बाई एम एंड स्लोप ऑफ नॉर्मल इज माइनस वन अपॉन स्लोप ऑफ टेंजेंट दैट इज द फॉर्मूला फॉर स्लोप ऑफ नॉर्मल सो लेट एस स्टार्ट विद द क्वेश्चन नाउ क्वेश्चन नंबर वन फाइंड द स्लोप ऑफ टेंजेंट And normal to the curve x square plus three y plus y square is equals to five at one one. We want to find slope of tangent and normal at this point. First, we want to find the value of dy upon dx. So differentiate this equation with respect to x. Differentiate with respect to x. What we get? Two x plus three dy upon dx. y square derivative of y square 2y dy upon dx derivative of constant term is zero from here what we get 2x plus 2y plus 3 dy upon dx is equals to zero or we get dy upon dx minus 2x upon 2y plus 3 now we want to find the slope at this point 1 1 Put x is equals to one and y is one, so we get slope of tangent as minus two by five. Slope of tangent is d by upon d x. Slope of tangent at point one one is minus two by five. Now slope of normal. What is the formula for slope of normal? Is minus one upon slope of tangent. So we get slope of normal as Five by two. Is it clear? सबसे पहले हमने dy dy upon dx की वैल्यू निकाली जिस पॉइंट पे स्लोप निकालने के लिए कहा है dy upon dx की वैल्यू में वो पॉइंट फुट करो x और y की वैल्यू वी गेट स्लोप ऑफ टेंजेंट एंड स्लोप ऑफ नॉर्मल इज माइनस वन अपॉन स्लोप ऑफ टेंजेंट नॉ द सेकेंड वन इज शो डेट द टेंजेंट टू द दिस एट पॉइंट एक्स टू एंड माइनस टू आर पैरल टू टेंजेंट आर पैरल इफ देर स्लोप ऑफ टेंजेंट इज इक्वल लेट स्लोप ऑफ टेंजेंट एट वन पॉइंट इज एम वन एंड अदर एट एम टू इफ एम वन और एम टू आर इक्वल इट मीन्स द टेंजेंट आर पैरल सो लेट एस फाइन डिफ्रेंशिएट विद रिस्पेक्ट टू एक्स थ्री इंटू टू सिक्स एक्स स्क्वेर डेरिवेटिव ऑफ थ्री इज जीरो नाउ वी वॉन्ट टू फाइंड द स्लोप ऑफ टेंजेंट एट एक्स टू टू स्क्वेर फोर ट्वेंटी फोर नाउ स्लोप ऑफ टेंजेंट एट एक्स इज इक्वल टू माइनस टू सिक्स माइनस टू स्क्वेर इज फोर ट्वेंटी फोर लेट दिस एज स्लोप एज एम वन एंड दिस एज एम टू नाउ एम वन इज इक्वल टू एम टू स्लोप ऑफ टेंजेंट एट एक्स टू इज इक्वल टू स्लोप ऑफ टेंजेंट एट माइनस टू देर फोर स्लोप ऑफ टेंजेंट एट पॉइंट टू एंड माइनस टू आर पैरल देर फोर द टेंजेंट एट पॉइंट एक्स इज इक्वल टू टू एंड एक्स इज इक्वल टू माइनस टू आर पैरल ना द नेक्स्ट वन इज क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन प्रूव दैट टेंजेंट टू द कर्व वाई एस एक्स स्क्वेर माइनस फाइव एक्स प्लस सिक्स एट पॉइंट टू जीरो एंड थ्री जीरो आर एट राइट एंगल्स द टू स्लोप टू टेंजेंट्स आर एट राइट एंगल इफ प्रोडक्ट ऑफ देयर स्लोप इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन सो लेट एस फाइन Differentiate derivative of x square, derivative of five. 
value of slope of tangent at point 20 x is 2 y is 0 4 minus 5 slope of tangent at point 30 2 into 3 6 minus 5 1 let this slope as m1 and this as m2 now m1 into m2 minus 1 into 1 minus 1 therefore the tangent at point this and at point this are perpendicular clear the slope of the curve 2y square is equals to ax square plus b at 1 minus 1 is minus 1 find a and b the slope of the curve at this point is equals to minus 1 now we want to find a and b differentiate 4y dy upon dx 2ax so we get dy upon dx is ax upon 2y now we want to find the slope of tangent at point 1 minus 1 x is 1 y is minus 1 and it is given that at this point slope is equals to minus 1 from here we get a is equals to 2 clear a is equals to 2 now we want to find the value of b also now this point 1 minus 1 lies on this equation write down 1 minus 1 lies on equation 1 so what we get x1 y minus 1 minus 1 square 1 square 2 is equals to a plus b a is also 2 so we get b as 0 so a is 2 and b is 0 2 we want to find dy upon dx to find slope of tangent first that will be equals to dy upon d theta d theta by dx differentiate x and y with respect to theta derivative of one constant term is zero derivative of sin is cos b derivative of cos square is 2 cos derivative of cos is minus sin theta put these values here dy upon d theta into d theta by dx reverse the term cos theta will get cancel negative sign will get cancel 2b upon a sin theta. Now we want to find the slope of tangent at point theta is equals to pi by 2. Put the value sin pi by 2. Sin 90 is 1. So 2b a 2b upon a. Now we want to find slope of normal. Slope of normal is equals to minus 1 upon slope of tangent so we get minus a upon 2b now the next one is find the slope of normal to the curve x is equals to a cos cube theta y is equals to a sin cube theta at theta is equals to pi by 4 we want to find slope of normal here Again, dy upon dx is equals to dy upon d theta into d theta by dx. Differentiate x and y with respect to theta. Derivative of cos cube three cos square. Derivative of cos is minus sine dy upon d theta. Derivative of sine cube three sine square. Derivative of sine is cos. Put the value d a upon d y upon d theta. Reverse d a theta upon d x. Three a cos square theta sine theta. Three a will get cancel. One sine and one cos. We have left with sine theta upon cos theta. Clear minus tan of theta. Now we want to find slope of tangent at theta is pi by four. Tan pi by four has value one. Now we want to find slope of tan slope of the normal. Slope of normal is equals to minus one upon slope of tangent. 
slope of normal minus 1 upon slope of tangent is minus 1. So we get the answer as 1. Clear? Next one. Find the points on the curve y is equal to x cube minus 2x square minus x at which tangent lines are parallel to the line this. Tangent lines are parallel to the line this. Now let P, X1, Y1 be a required point. This point will lie on this curve. So we get Y1 as x1 cube minus 2x1 square minus x1. Let this equation as 1. Now differentiate 1 with respect to x. To find slope of tangent. dy upon dx 3x square minus 4x minus 1. Now slope of tangent at the required point x1 y1 is. 3x1 square minus 4x1 minus 1. Now slope of tangent of this curve is parallel to the slope of line this. If two tangents are parallel then their slopes are equal. This is the given line. Find the slope of this line. dy upon dx is 3. Now we get 3x1 square minus 4x1, 3x1 square minus 4x1 minus 4. Now factorize it. On multiplication we want minus 12 and on adding and subtracting we want minus 4. Factorize. Minus 4 on adding and subtracting and on multiplication 12. 6 into 2 is 12 and 6 minus 2 is 4. So minus 6 plus 2. Minus 6 ko 2 se multiply karenge. Then we get minus 12. Minus 6 plus 2 is minus 4. Now take 3 x1 common. x1 minus 2 plus 2 x1 minus 2. x1 minus 2 3 x1 plus 2. We get x1 as 2 or x1 as minus 2 by 3. First this term goes 0 ke equal rakhenge. Then we get this term. When this term is equal to 0, then x1 is this. Now we want to find the value of y1. When x1 is 2, 2 cube, 2 square minus 2. 8, 2 square, 4 into 2. So we get y1 as minus 2. When x is minus 2 by 3, minus 2 by 3 cube, minus 2 by 3 square, minus minus plus 2 by 3, minus 8 by 27, minus square is plus 4 by 9, 4 into 2, 8 by 9, plus 2 by 3, minus 8. Minus 24 plus 18. So what we get? Y1 is equals to 18 minus 8. 10. Minus 24 minus 10. Minus 14 by 27. So the required point is when x2 y minus 2. And when x is minus 2 by 3, y is minus 14 by 27. Clear? dy upon dx 4x 
minus 6. Let the required point be x1, y1. Now slope of tangent at point x1, y1. 4 x1 minus 6. 4 x1 minus 6. Now it is given that tangent is parallel to x axis. If the tangent is parallel to x axis, then slope of tangent is equal to 0. Then slope of tangent is 0. Slope of tangent means dy upon dx is equals to 0. From here we get x1 as 3 by 2. x1 as 3 by 2. Now point x1 by 1 lies on equation 1. So we get y1 as 2x1 square minus 6x1 minus 4. Now x1 is 3 by 2. Put this point here. Minus 6 into 3 by 2 minus 4. 3 into 3, 9 into 2, 18, 2 square. Minus 18 by 2 minus 4. 18, 4 into 4 is 16. 18 minus 16 is 2. So minus 34 by 4. When x is 3 by 2, y is minus 17 by 2. So this is the required point. Parallel to x-axis, 